All right, well, this is one of those hunts where if it can go wrong, it will go wrong. Um, so this is about the third time this tree, and I've had an encounter every uh, time that I hunted it. Um, this time I was hunting it in the evening, and I, I did some, some grunts, and then all of a sudden I had two young, um, looks like a button buck and a spike come in. Uh, now, again, this was uh, an antler restriction, uh, but I was really wanting to fill the tag in that button buck would have been a legal deer so if he presented a shot opportunity I was definitely going to take that um, but you know being able again transitioning from cameraman to shooter while self-filming uh, is really difficult because once you let that you have to anticipate where the shot is going to be and where the deer is going to be because once you let go of that camera and start uh, transitioning to going to full draw all bets are off uh, and letting back down something I have hard time doing uh, it, it just doesn't happen very often uh, but uh, in this case well let's just see what happens Folks, there's my arrow. I just ranged that. That is 10 yards. I cannot believe I missed that. Stinking little deer. He's right there. Boy, my tree's down. Couldn't ask for a better shot. I don't know what happened. All right, folks. Well, we're starting to move through the first part of November, and this just happened to be my last vacation day I had available to me. Um, and so I set up on a doe tree where I've had success um, every time it was in the first week of November. If the plan, So I planned for the win for that same scenario. Uh, doe comes right down broadside, uh, sometimes 40, sometimes 30 yards right in front of me. Um, so the wind is is blowing from uh, my left to the right and lo and behold here comes a uh, doe coming down straight towards me right in uh, to my crosswind and it wasn't it wasn't long about 30 minutes or so after that uh, uh, a big 10 point came right down uh, the trail facing me um, in my excitement and the difficulty in self filming uh, I, I I hit the record button but I must have double tapped it because I only got a split second footage of this big 10 point it came right basically to the base of the tree uh, heard me go to draw bound off and I got it to stop long enough to take a shot uh, but unfortunately I missed that clean a clean miss on a big 10 point and was unable to catch it on film check it out Again, I thought I had pushed record and had this large, tall, nice 10 point in my viewfinder all the way to the base of my tree at 5 yards.